God, our Heavenly Father, whose hands are the living and the dead, give thee thanks for all those thy servants who have laid down their lives. Grant to them thy mercy and the light of thy presence, that the good work which thou hast begun in them may be perfected. Through Jesus Christ, thy Son, our Lord. Amen. The battle ended at sunset. Time seemed to go backwards, as though night would never come. The blasted landscape around Sharpsburg smoldered and smoked, filled with the pitiful cries of thousands of wounded men. Every bullet that strikes near you is a new terror. How slowly time passes. After the carnage, both sides paused to reckon the horror. The next day there was no renewed attack. Lee withdrew across the Potomac to fight on for three more bitter years. But the southern campaign of invasion had failed. The Federals had regained the initiative. In the West, too, the Confederates collapsed. In Britain and France, the moment for recognition had passed. The great Confederate offensive was beaten back, leaving in its wake thousands of survivors who shuddered in the face of death. Only they know the agony, desolation, and pain of war. deal about the relationship of this war to slavery. When the rebels had been driven out of Maryland, I made a promise to myself and my maker to issue a proclamation of emancipation. It is now for the country and the world to pass judgment. A week after the Battle of Antietam, Lincoln released a powerful weapon the Emancipation Proclamation, declaring slaves in rebellious states forever free. The preserver of the Republic was now the great emancipator. At Antietam, Lincoln accumulated vivid impressions. His melancholy thoughts were deeply layered, reflecting the agony and irony of civil war. He knew there would be more battle, more death, more sorrow. Well, it's had a long and dry time, but tears come to my eyes. I thought of her, I love so well, those early broken ties. I visited the old churchyard, Took some flowers to stroll Upon the graves of those we loved Upon the graves of those we loved Some twenty years ago Some are in the churchyard laid Some sleep beneath the sea are left of our old class, accepting me. And when our time shall come, Tom, and we are called to go, I hope they'll lay us well. 